Hi, happy July 4th. Um, I just put the the one little American flag that we have out by the mailbox. Um, it's just on a little one on a stick. That's, a, oh, I don't know, that's all we can seem to have in this house. I thought we had a different American flag, but we don't. At least I can't find it. So that's just getting ready for celebrations. I need to find the leaf blower. Yeah, we have a leaf blower in our kitchen. Doesn't everyone? I blow the leaves and things off the patio all the time, so I never quite make it back to the garage with it. So we decorate our kitchen with a leaf blower, you know? These things happen. Hubby needs it out front because he's doing some landscaping stuff. Um, just kind of trimming the bushes and things, I'll show you. Really need to do these. Kind of go, what do you want to trim them, or what do you call it? Um, you know, prune them. Those took off like crazy. So this is how we sneak around from the front to the side without walking all around. We walk through this little tiny space between the bushes. <laughs> Gracie in. There's my chair. My garden has done so beautifully. Look at this. The flowers just went crazy. got knocked down because of the big rains we had but for the most part they're great my green beans are doing well I have some on there I could probably pick this is an orange tree Here's my herbs I'm pretty sure I have some beans in here somewhere yep I see them look at them there they are I need to go pick those have my tomatoes doing really well. This one's got a lot of tomatoes on it. If you can see in there, it's hard to see. But there are bunches, bunches and bunches. Yeah, got a lot of blooms here. That's what the back looks like right now. Okay, I had the, the uh, stand for the hammock right there. And we have to bring the thing into the garage and it's quite a trip all the way around this way, all the way around that way, over to the garage. So we, you know, you have to really be committed to a hammock time to do that and then put it back again. It's very heavy. So my husband and I dragged it up there onto that little deck. And it's wonderful up there because you can just go in and out with it real easily, but it looks terrible. You know, it really ruins the whole vibe of that deck. <laughs> but I love it, I've been really loving it. So anyway, we're working on cleaning some stuff up and yeah, yeah, that's what's happening. Pretty, huh? So what I did this morning, woke up, just kind of let my, you know, showered and let my hair kind of dry in its natural state of crunchiness. Um, it's got this weird little bit of a wave to it. So I put on some, um, what is that called? It's beach, beach spray, I think it's called. And sort of let it air dry and this is what it ends up looking like. And then I'll try to do something better with it a little bit later. But today we're just having a relaxing time. Jim's doing yard work and I am just kind of cleaning up the house a little bit and doing my garden stuff. And um, a little bit later on, we're going to have, uh, let's see, Claire here, Gracie here. Um, Callan's gonna be here. 
uh, all people that are, you know, within our normal group of people. And we're going to be on the patio and we're going to just be grilling and, um, you know, just having easy food. That's just sort of uh, what we're gonna do and sort of social distance, but, but enjoy the holiday and then probably do a fire pit later on this afternoon or this evening, I guess, and roast some marshmallows or whatever. And that is going to be our July 4th celebration. Okay, see the hammock takes over the entire area. We have all that space with nothing in it at the moment, really. But we have this, um, it's a mess right now, but anyway, we have this little corner thing um, and a shade sail on top for shade. So I sit out here all the time and there was all that space and I kept thinking, I would love to go do the hammock out there in the woods, but I don't wanna drag this whole thing out there. So yeah, instead we brought it up here thinking it might just fit in that little section there, but no, it's way bigger than we thought. So for the last couple days, I've just been laying out here reading and stuff every once in a while. I know this is not gonna stay because it's ridiculous, but um, yeah, it just, it's so nice to be able to do it so much more often because it's right here close to the house. I don't know, I'll figure something out. But I keep thinking there must be a way to put it I don't know, maybe even closer to the patio somewhere, but the patio is kind of raised and you have to go down steps to get to the yard. I don't know. It's just, it's nice out there, but it just is a pain to drag this in and out. Cause seriously, we have animals get stuck in it. Deer have run into it. And then when it gets wet, I mean, it's water weatherproof, but it still soaks in eventually. So it's much better to take it out back in the house every time. I don't know. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but for now, I'm gonna jump in it and enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, we got a broom, excuse the mess, but yeah, this is, I put that up there for, I can sit out there in the rain even, it's wonderful. So yeah, it's awful, but I love it. So what we're going to be doing for the cookout basically is hamburgers and hot dogs, and I'm going to make a caprese, a caprese salad with tomato slices and mozzarella and basil and a balsamic drizzle. Um, that's all I know so far. Fruit salad. I'm still working on the rest of it. So that's what's happening here. I thought I would just quickly come on and say happy 4th of July to you and let you know what's happening here. I hope you guys are having a fantastic time. Enjoy. And I hope you're having a great summer so far. Thanks. Bye.